Hey guys, I'm Gamer Mate. Welcome back to a new video. So I'm here back inside Roblox Studio. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to create a very own hunger system. So let's go into a video. So the first thing you need to do is click Service Script Service, click the plus, and then add in a script. Once we have our script, we can move print hello world. Then we can type in game dot players dot player added colon connect two brackets function once again two more brackets and then player go down and now we can type in player dot character added colon connect two brackets function and then character once again go down and then we can type in local leader stats equals to instance dot new two brackets and then folder then in between these speech marks and brackets we can type in comma and then player go down then leader stats dot name equals to and then speech marks and then now we can type in leader stats like that we we'll go down twice and type in local hunger equals to instance dot new two brackets and then number value then in between speech marks and brackets we we'll type in comma leader stats and then go down then we'll type in hunger dot name equals to speech marks and then hunger go down now we'll do hunger dot value equals to and then let's do 100 then we go down twice and now we can do repeat wait one second then go down you should see this new until appear so in between these two lines we can type in hunger dot value equals to then math dot clamp two brackets then we can type in hunger dot value minus and then the amount of hunger you want to take away. So this could be 10, then comma. Then what this number is, is the least it can go to, which is going to be zero. Then once again, comma. And then this is going to be the maximum, which is 100. But if you want, you can change the numbers of these to change if you want it to go past 100 or under zero into minus numbers. And then underneath this until, we could do hunger dot value is less than or equals to zero and then go down once we go down we can type in character dot humanoid dot health equals to zero so all this does is when the hunger reaches zero then the character dies and guys that's going to be it for this script so if we close it off now what we can do is add in a part make sure it's anchored and then we can rename this to food. Now we can change colour and size like this. And then inside of this, we can click plus, add in a script, and then type in script.parent.touched colon connect two brackets function and then hit. Go down and new end should appear with a bracket. And then we can type in local player equals to game dot players colon get player from character two brackets and then do hit dot parent and then go down then we do player dot leader stats dot hunger dot value equals to math dot clamp two brackets and then once again we can do player dot leader stats dot hunger dot value plus and then let's give them 25 food every time they step on it then once again comma zero comma and then 100 then underneath this we can go down and type in script dot parent colon destroy and then two brackets and that should be it for this food script so if we close it off and let's just quickly duplicate a few apples around. Here we go. So if we click play. And then once we load in, you can see that our hunger is going down. Then if we step on some food, 
they can see fine it adds 25 like this then once our hunger reaches zero then you can see that our player actually dies and guys that's gonna be it for today's video if this video helped make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe down below in the description you can check out my robot group and discord server and i'll see you later bye